Colorado Plateau in northern Arizona is Vermilion Cliffs National Monument. The cliffs just rise out of the plateau hundreds of feet. I wish I would have had more time to visit. Well, I finally made it to Utah. Now, way back in Illinois, I had bumped into these Italian guys in three different locations on Route 66, and here they are in Utah. Well, as usual, it took me a lot longer to get to Bryce Canyon than I thought, but I was looking forward to getting an early start and seeing the sights in Bryce Canyon. Unfortunately, right outside where I was staying, there was a half marathon. They shut the roads down, so I was behind two hours already, but things were about to look up. Good morning. Good you? All right, so I was in um, Grand Canyon yesterday, and they said that I got seven days if I want to buy an annual. Huh? Columbus, Ohio. Thank you, Amanda. Yeah, all the way up to Maine and back. Somewhere. Probably. Thank you so much. You too. It was the cutest ranger I've seen. Maybe it wasn't 1.3 million miles, but it sure felt like that. My next stop was the Grand Staircase Esplanade National Monument. Now, since I was in the area, I was told I had to try the Cotton Canyon Road. It goes right through the Grand Staircase National Monument. It was roughly 50 miles of sensational backcountry roads with the most spectacular views along the way. Couldn't wait to ride this. Park in Moab, which I was hoping to stop at. 
Uh, yeah, Houston, we may have a problem. 30 miles. <laughs> And I've got a road closure. It would be a long, long, long way to go around. Let's see what this uh, looks like. Okay, it's not going to do that. Yeah. decided that I was going to do my Superman impression of flying, just to make up some time. Really don't think it worked though. scenery has changed for hundreds, even thousands of years. It really is an amazing area.
starting to set now, and it brought out such vibrant colors in the rock, in the sand, even in the sky. The reds just were so deep and rich. As spectacular as the views were, I had to make my way off of the gravel road and find a main road. I still needed to figure out where I was going to stay for the night. But what an amazing day it's been, and another incredible day on the Go West Young Man Road Trip. <laughs>